everyone, welcome back to my channel and this week I am going to do this look for you which is a kind of natural no makeup makeup look. I did a lip gloss on the lips but I've given you another two ideas to make it look like you've not actually worn any makeup which is very nice and I do like it, it just gives a little bit of, brings out your kind of more natural beauty if you wanted to add that. Again the most natural look that you could ever do and the most beautiful is without any makeup. However, I like to do this on occasions uh, where I don't want to look too overdone. So if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up, do comment down below and do hit that subscribe button and let's hop straight into the makeup look. So first things first I like to use my Sultan Protect and Go Sun Care Lotion. I then like to take my Clean and Clear Dual Action Moisturiser which is oil free and I just rub that into my skin. Then to prime my face I take my number 7 Airbrush Away Primer which just helps to keep your makeup on all day. And as I'm going for a no makeup makeup look today, I did not want to use a foundation as that can look quite fake if you don't get the right one. If you have a nice one, use it, but I'm just using my Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. Then for under my eyes, I am taking my collection Lasting Perfection Concealer in number one Fair. I'm just putting three dots under each eye as I don't want to highlight my face, I just want to take away the dark circles. For my eyebrows, I will use my HD Brows Kit and a angled brush. I will take the same two colours as I use for every time I do my eyebrows and I won't fill them in heavily. I will then take my little brush and I will comb them through to make them look as natural as possible. Then to set my base I will take my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder in 001 Transparent and a big fluffy brush for all around my face and a more angled brush for under the eyes. I will take my Bourjois bronzing powder which looks and smells of chocolate and it's amazing and a nice bronzer brush and I will just bronze up my cheeks and my forehead not too much. For blusher I'll take my Technique blusher which has actually cracked, I don't know how that's happened but it has um, and I will also take my blusher brush and just put a little bit on my cheeks. Now for eyeshadow primer I will take my Urban Decay primer potion in the original one just to keep my eyeshadow on all day. And at the beginning I actually forgot to scrub and balm my lips so I'm using the Metal Panda Bubblegum Lip Scrub and their lip balm. On to the eyes. I am taking my Colours by Technique palette. It's quite a cheapy brand but it's got the right colours in it so I'm taking this middle colour and it's just really really good for um, a natural look on the eyes. It is, it's more my colour of skin which is what you want, you want quite natural. But then I'm mixing two of the other colours next to it to create a kind of good colour for my crease just to add a little bit of definition down there. For the inner corner of my eyes I will take my flat shader brush and a highlighty colour and I will just put a little tad of that right in my inner corner. I will then curl my lashes very slightly just to give them a little bit more volume and I've got three choices for mascara for you today. I've got a just plain brown one and then I've got a collection longer lash mascara in number three brown black and then I've got a Rimmel uh, super lash or whatever it is in number 10 brown black so you've got brown black ones and a brown one I like to go with a brown black one for most of my lashes and then a brown one just on the bottom lashes as I find this looks very natural for my lips I have three options for you again you can go for a plain lip balm which um, this one's the Nivea one and it has SPF 15 which is good for summer days. You also have a Vaseline in there which is not my favourite thing to use as it does dry out your lips. I would not recommend this highly. And then you've got a Makeup Gallery lip gloss which is very natural looking and it's actually very hydrating. It That was 
is my kind of natural-ish, uh, no makeup makeup look. Uh, not very many products, not a heavy foundation or anything, and I think it looks really pretty. It's a nice kind of everyday look if you don't want to look like you put tons of effort into it, and I like it. I wear it quite often. So if you like this video, then please give it a like, comment down below, and do hit that subscribe button, as I would love to have more of you join me. Over on Instagram, please come and join me over there. I've been Instagramming a lot more recently as I have got some new nails and also some bunny slippers. So I've been Instagramming a lot more and I quite like um, my Instagram at the moment. Follow me on Facebook to see random things that I'm going to put up. If I get more people following me on Facebook, I'll probably put some more statuses up often. Twitter as well, I'll try and tweet more. And I'll really try and do a lot more like that. Please leave any comments down below of any ideas or videos that you'd like to see as I would much appreciate it. I have got videos planned but I just like some more. Thank you for all your lovely comments on all of my other videos and hopefully you'll like this one so I'll see you guys next week. Bye!